2000 brings an interesting crop of rookies to the NASCAR Craftsman Truck Series that have a great shot at stardom. Greg Biffle emerged from the pack in 1999 with nine wins and a runner-up finish for the championship. Greg used the NASCAR ESPN Winter Heat Series to attract the attention of Benny Parsons and secure a spot with Roush Racing's truck team. When I met Greg Biffle, he was, I think, 25 years old. He had just finished second in the, in the NASCAR Winston Racing Series. He won 17 out of 24 at Portland or wherever racetrack that he ran on. And he came to Tucson, Arizona, for winter heat, sat on the pole at all 100 laps or whatever it was, 150. And I go down and talk to him. He can, you know, speak fairly well. And he builds race cars for a living. I mean, that was a no-brainer. Since Biffle, I haven't seen that package. I look and I see some guys that I think are, uh, you know, Kurt Busch, the young man that's going to drive for Jack Roush this year, the Exide truck. I think that Kurt Busch has a, a very successful career in front of him in NASCAR racing because I think he has a tremendous amount of time. Bush is the reigning NASCAR Featherlight Southwest Tour Series champion and passed a track test with Roush with flying colors to earn his ride. Everything was moved so quickly. I didn't think that uh, I was going to be the one that they had chosen. And uh, it was quite unique the way they uh, had the interview process. We actually did hands-on and drove the truck. And uh, they picked on who drove the truck the best. It was a really unique situation, kind of pressure-filled. And uh, down in Phoenix, that helped out. Being in the Southwest, that helped out with uh, making me do a little bit better. With experience on many of the Western tracks where the truck series competes, Kurt is already on an upswing in his learning curve. We've set a few numbers out. We want rookie of the year. That's the main goal. That's what we're going to shoot at and work on the top five finishes. And uh, if that puts us in a top five points position at the end of the year, that's, that's a, a great goal, and we achieved our goals this year.